Did you know that we can make it rain in Hello Kitty Island Adventure? Let me show you how. First, you need a quest with Retsuko. This should appear once you reach level 17 with her and finish the swimming quest. When you go to Retsuko, she'll tell you she found this strange chest watched up on the beach of Mount Hothead. You go there together, and once you open it up, you find a mysterious treasure map. Now you have to take it around to ask a bunch of your friends. Most of them aren't really sure what it is. You don't really learn anything, but when you go back to the beach, where Karomi and Bats tell you that they've been examining the area around the kelp maze because they think it might be haunted or have some mysterious magic or aliens or blah 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 blah. The classics. And they did find this structure that seemed kind of like ruins. This is essential to making it rain on your island. So of course, Choco Cat says he'll help you figure it out what it is and fix it up. Choco Cat figures out it's called an aquafaller. And this is the key to making it rain on the island. And you'll need to craft this rain island stone to put into the aquafaller. So in general, this quest with Retsuko sets off two other quests that by the end, you will be able to make it rain. So after the second quest is done with the island stone, it'll start this third quest. So you have to go down to the aquafaller with Choco Cat, put the stone in, and obviously you can't tell that it's raining when you're underwater. So you have to head back to the seaside resort plaza with Choco Cat, where you will find rain. It's been a success. So now it will randomly rain in a part of the island, and each island's a little bit different. So in the Gemstone Mountain, when it rains, you will be able to find a rare slug. This only happens in Gemstone when it rains. It's called the Soaking Slugler. And then on Mount Hothead when it rains, you will be able to find a rare fish near the ponds in the oasis. And then on the Seaside Resort, Merry Meadow, or the Spooky Swamp, you'll be able to find these blue flower buds that when you water them, they spit out a raindrop. These raindrops are used to buy new wallpapers and raincoats and rain hats in the shops. There are a few new wallpapers in my Melody shop that you can use the raindrops to purchase. And then in Tuxedo Sam shop, there are raincoats and rain hats. You can dye the plain ones, different colors. And then there's also a ducky one, which matches some of the wallpapers, which is my favorite. Make sure to bring top hat with you when you pick up the raindrops because you have the ability to get two instead of one. So that will maximize the amount of raindrops you can get. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.